Well, hello, 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 everyone. This is your girl Zengaya, the Zen Libra, and welcome, 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 welcome to my channel. Woman is God. Woman, you know that you're God, right? You know that you're a God in this realm. You are the connection. You are the spirituality. You are the connection between this physical and the divine. You're God, ladies. You're God. Thank you for joining me for What's the Word? What's the Word? And what's the word we're working with the zodiac sign today of Aries? All right. Well, what's the word? I pull letters, um, consonants, uh, or they may end up as words. Um, I do this to strengthen the third eye, okay, to make us better seers, you know, so that we can see things and navigate properly throughout this matrix. The English, the English language is just a spell. You know what I'm saying? Um, our um, language only consists of its symbolism and it was consonants. There were no vowels. Okay. So a lot of times I'm going to pull up words, I mean, letters without vowels. And this is the way that the powers uh, that be hide things from you. Okay. Um, they hide things from you in clear sight because we have gone away from the way that we used to communicate, which is with consonants and symbolism. We've uh, adapted their way of living, you know, so we don't see a lot of things because they're dull. We haven't used our skills, so you haven't used your eyes, so it hurts when you're trying to see. But we need to see, ladies, we need to see. This is a part of us getting back to our emperor status. This is a part of us getting our throne back. You know what I'm saying? We have to strengthen that third eye. We have to be able to see in the spiritual, okay? All right. So what's the word going on in Aries energy? The first letter that I pulled was O. The second letter I pulled was G. And the third letter I pulled was technology. T. Technology just came out. So, wow. This is some type of technology, okay? So the word that sets in the the energy of the Aries is OGT. So we're going to look OGT up, guys. I want you to go to your source, uh, whatever you use to look up words. Um, it could be your thesaurus, your dictionary, or um, anything that you use to look up words. So you can go to your Google, your thesaurus, your dictionary, Wikipedia, whatever it is you use to look up things. And we're going to look up OGT. All right, guys? I'm going to look it up. But look it up with me, guys. It's interesting. And you'll be able to put this into your subconscious. So when you do see these uh, words that you think don't have no meaning, you will know that they that they do. And... Um, You'll be able to navigate. you know what these things are. A lot of things will become clearer to you. Okay? So let's look it up. OGT. All right. Okay, guys. I looked it up. What did you get? I got Oxford Genome Technology. Do you hear what I said? Oxford, that, that when I say Oxford, that should go up. That that the eyebrow should raise, but genome, eyebrow should raise, and technology. What we got here is hybridization. This company mixes two species together. To create a new species. Hybridization. Wow. So it's just like mixing. Um, a horse. With a mule. You know what I'm saying? And you get the, uh, is it the horse and the mule? 
But you get the you you get the donkey. I mean, you get the mule. What do you mix the horse with? But whatever it is, I forgot. You know what I'm saying? You look it up. Whatever you mix it with, you create another species. But this species is not able to create. You know, it's it's crazy. You know, uh, so we're I want to not necessarily cloning, but you're creating a whole other species by mixing two different species together. You're creating a whole different, you know, you're mixing DNA. They're playing God, people. They're playing God. Oxford. <laughs> so you know uh, what's up with that. Okay? You know what's up with that. So this is what's going on in the energy of the Aries. Feminine. Oh, my goodness. Somebody from another species is trying to mix with you. You have this company that's trying to get your DNA so they can mix your DNA with this other thing so they can make something new out of you and this particular thing that they're mixing it, that they're mixing your DNA with. Wow. All right, let's get some tarot on this, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Making hybrid, hybridization. Yeah, that's what they're doing, y'all. They're trying to... What is going on with that? Mm, mm, mm. I tell you, it gets dark over here, don't it? I keep telling you, Divine Feminine, I'll be telling them, bitch, you don't know my life. You know what I'm saying? We going through people trying to uh, mix with us. It could be some reptilian trying to mix with you. It could be an insectoid trying to mix with you. You know what I'm saying? It could be a demon trying to mix with you and make something new. Oh, who knows? But whatever it is, it's a totally different species, okay, from you. Totally foreign to you. It could be an animal. Mixing it with a human, making something. I mean, that's how a dog was made. The dog is mixed with, is mixed of, of a human and a, and a, um, a wolf. Made a whole new different species. That's why the dog has feelings. Okay? Um, and that's what they're trying to do with your DNA. Aries. Wow. Wickedness. 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 Now see guys, if you were just walking out on the street, you wouldn't know what an OGT means. But now you know. Because you looked it up. These are people that's trying to <laughs> mix you with something else to make a new creation. Okay. Wow. Hybridization. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's get some tarot on this. What is up with this spirit? Mm, mm, mm. I'll tell you. What is up with this? Mm. All right. You got this King of Swords here that wants to build a foundation with you. This person wants to wants a marriage, a commitment, uh, to do life with you. They want you guys to live together. They want to be in a partnership with you, Aries. They want to go out and live a whole new world with you. I mean, this person thinks that it's their destiny, that you're in their destiny. And they want to be in a commitment. They want to be in this love connection. They want to, you are the ultimate to them. They want to be with you. And they don't want nobody else. They don't want nobody else. This could have been somebody that's a player that sleeps around with a whole lot of women. But now, this person doesn't want to juggle anymore. He only wants you. Okay? This person only wants you. And they're trying to figure out how they can get you or figure out how they can sacrifice you. Hmm. Wow. They're trying to figure out. This person um, is trying to do something for some money. This person is trying to use you for some money. Okay. This person is getting paid to get in a connection with you. Because of your DNA. 
This person is not human. Okay? Or they're probably got mixed human with them with something else. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm hearing reptilian. This king of swords is a reptilian. He's not of your genome at all. Okay? And he wants to come over to your house. He wants to live with you. He wants to do life with you. He wants y'all to be in this partnership, this connection. He don't want nobody else but you because he's having financial setbacks over there. Okay? A lot is going on in his life and he needs you. So he wants to try to trap you. Mm -hmm. He wants to, he's putting a lot of time and energy to get you trapped for some time away. I don't know if he wants to kidnap you or uh, bind you up, throw you in a trunk. I don't know, trying to get into your mental, but he's putting a lot of time and energy into this because he will get paid handsomely if he was to get you pregnant because you guys' DNA are totally different and you will create a whole new species. See, these people, or this person is trying to bring something into this world, but he needs you to bring it through. Okay, he needs your DNA because you are the divine feminine. You have the divine energy. So he's going to get paid handsomely if he procreates with you. Okay, nobody but you. Nobody but you. Okay, wow. So this this um this company, this Oxford Genome um technology place, um wants to pay him to come over there and try to have sex with you and get you pregnant and create this I don't want to say child but I don't know what it will be you know what I'm saying um <laughs> this person is having financial setbacks over there he's juggling his finances and he don't want to juggle his finances no more he needs resources Okay, this could be somebody, um, of course, he wants a commitment, but this could be somebody that is in a church or over a church or this could be a preacher or somebody, you know. Um, he wants to speak to you. Okay, he wants to speak to you. Um, he wants to move forward with you in this connection and he's working hard with this group. Okay. To damage you, to off you, to, to, I don't know, to just end your, end, unalive you. I mean, he wants to attack you. You know what I'm saying? I mean, he's putting all type of knives in your back. You know? Wow. This group is willing to pay him handsomely. If they could combine your DNA with his and make this. You know what I'm saying? So he's been paid and bribed to do this okay this is what he's been bribed to do y'all oh my goodness this person is a piece of dung you know what i'm saying um this person can't get you he can't get you emotionally he can't get you um this is somebody from your past that you used to deal with you probably had sex with this person in the past but it was nothing serious okay this probably was a booty call or something you know what i'm saying or friends with benefits or something like that it didn't last long but this person was able to get you in the bed. So this group, because now it's not easy to get you in the bed. So this group goes to him. And they know this person is in financial trouble. And it's like, we will pay you if you could sleep with her. Because we want to combine her DNA with yours. So we can make this whatever it is. And he took the bribe. Mm hmm he took the bribe. This is people, this is a church community, y'all. What I tell y'all about these churches. Look at what they're doing. Hybridization. These people in the churches are reptilian. They're not human, y'all. These are demons. What I tell you, y'all, get about these churches. And they're trying to unalive this feminine. They're trying to sacrifice her. They want her blood. They want her DNA so they can make a new species with this reptilian here. Okay, he's having financial hardship over there. He needs resources. He's tired of juggling his resources and he needs you. 
and he wants to move forward with this connection. And he's he's he, he's working hard with this group to get you in a partnership with him so you can open your legs to him. This is a church group, y'all. This is some type of uh, fraternal order or something. This is what they do. They sacrifice people. And they take divine energy and they mix it with this beast energy. And they make a whole new species. Wow. How wicked, huh? And this is what's going on in your energy, Aries. What's the word for Aries? It's Oxford, Oxford Genome Technology Institute. Where they focus on what they do is they do hybrid, hybridization there. You can look that word up. So it can be in your mental Rolodex when you see that word. But it means to combine two different DNA strands to make one new. Two totally different species. Wow. Mm, mm, mm. Woo. Let me... Uh, mm, mm, mm. Ain't that something, y'all? I tell you, Divine Feminine, they don't know our life now. You know what I'm saying? Look at what we go through. Look at this darkness. They're trying to clone us, girl. They're trying to... You know what I'm saying? Wow, Aries. Wow. This is, of course, I feel like this. This person don't want to juggle his resources no more. You know what I'm saying? Um, wow. Mm, mm, mm. This person don't want to juggle his resources. And they took the, you know, he wants to be comfortable. He needs resources. He wants to be comfortable. So he put a price tag on your freaking life, Aries. This king of swords did this. Mm -hmm. This person want to be comfortable so y'all can grow together. You know what I'm saying? Um, this person is cuckoo. You know what I'm saying? This person is trying to control you. Okay? Trying to control you. And he's determined too. Yeah, he's trying to get you pregnant. He's trying to grow a seed within you. He's taking money to do this. They sought him out, you know. They sought him out. And he took the bribe. What an asshole, right? To sacrifice you to this group so that they can kind of clone you, so they can take your DNA with this bastard's and make a whole new species. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He wants y'all to come together so he can create with you, girl. Mm-hmm. Trying to get you pregnant. Trying to create a new beast. You know what I'm saying? Because it will be part of him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, and he working hard. He working hard to get you in this partnership. He feels that you are his destiny. That he's destined to be with you. That this is the way it's supposed to be. And he's working hard to get with you so he can get you pregnant. Wow. Yeah. And this little bastard, he's confident that he could do it too. He's very arrogant. I guess he thought because he got you in the bed in the past that he could just be the one, done, the done one, and get you back in there again today and get you pregnant. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. He knows what your DNA is now. And he regrets not being with you. See, this is a player. You know what I'm saying? He he never uh, settles down. But he regrets not settling down with you because you're so special. Since this group uh, approached him to get at you. He's like, what's so special about her? She's divine. He's like, oh, man, I can't believe she's who she is. And I was out here partying, having threesomes, swinging and stuff. And I, and I left our love connection in the back. But I'm going to try to get it back. You know what I'm saying? And he working hard with this group to move in with you, get some foundation. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just to disrupt your harmony. Just to disrupt your harmony, disrupt your life. This group is working hard at this because this masculine wants to be with you in a relationship, get you in the house so he can start working on getting you pregnant. 
This will totally disrupt your life. This will totally disrupt your movement, uh, moving forward. He feels that this will stop you from moving forward in life because he feels you're leaving him behind because you are elevated. And he feels that if he could stop you moving forward in life, he could, if he could disrupt you, if he could just come to your house, get you in a relationship with him, because all he needs to do then is all she wrote. And him and his group is working so hard, trying their best to sacrifice you for this money. What this uh, Oxford Genome place is giving this person because they're trying to hybridization. Okay? Yeah. Mm hmm. And he's sad over there. He's sad over there. Mm hmm. Or he wants you sad. He's sad that you ended the cycle with him before he was able to take your life. Mm hmm. He said that you ended the cycle with him before he was able to take your life because you're very intuitive and you followed your intuition. You knew something just went right and you weren't dealing with this person. Okay. You was not dealing with this person. You know, you had a feeling about this person over him and his group. You were using magic on you to get you to fall in love and want to be with this particular person. <laughs> this particular person is a beast he's he's has like some animal he i think he's reptilian you know what i'm saying i'm gonna pull a card and see in a minute but he's not human y'all he is mixed with some beast wolf or something and he's hungering for your divine energy he's hungering for your energy okay but this is the end of this person trying to in this group trying to get you to be with him so he can Harness your energy. You know, you've been through a lot with this bastard. And it's time for you to have a rest. Spirit says it's time for you to rest, honey. Because this cycle is over. You know what I'm saying? And you know what made it over? You've probably been going through this for years for this person. But you became conscious of what this person was doing. See, when you become conscious, they can't play around you. You know what I'm saying? You are very much aware. You know what I'm saying? And because you, you came conscious to what he was doing... You had success that you got through this. Okay? Success. And this person is not... You're not dealing with this person. And he's over there in pain. He's hurt. Because you're strong. You're very strong. And you're balanced. He couldn't get at you. You know what I'm saying? Things are growing for you in your life, which he didn't want it to. And you're moving forward. You're moving forward in life. You ended this cycle with him. And he said, be cautious of this person. Be cautious of this person. Okay? There's nothing to fear, though. We don't want you to live in fear. Okay? We don't want you to live in fear. You will have peace from this particular person. You will have peace from this particular person. So don't worry about it. Wow. Ain't that something, y'all? Ain't that something? This is a person that's trying to mix with this feminine, and he's not even human, y'all. He's not even human, y'all. See, we don't know what is out here that's following us, y'all. Everybody wants our energy. Everybody wants our energy to try to, because they can't get us to come to the dark side. So they want to get a, a, some, a clone of us to come to the dark side. Because if they can't have all of our energy, they would definitely take some. And so this is supposed to be a baby, you and this person. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's crazy. They're trying to get your DNA, sweetie. They're trying to get your DNA. They're probably checking your trash. Don't put your uh, your um, your um maxi pads or tampons or something in the trash. Do something else with them. You know what I'm saying? Don't cut your hair or put it in the trash. You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't think anything else. Don't put spit in the trash or anything. Don't put any band-aids or anything in the trash because these people will go so far as because they pay these people really well and this person is getting paid really well 
that he got this group to help him. You know what I'm saying? So this group is going to benefit from this person having this child with you. Okay? But you ended the cycle. Yeah, you ended it with him and you blocked his ass. And he's like, can you unblock me, please? No, I don't want to talk to you. You're trying to sacrifice me, you bastard. Unblock you for what? You're totally out of my life, blocked on my social media, on my phone. I don't want anything to do with you, dude. You know what I'm saying? Divine wants you to conserve your sexual energy. Do not sleep with this person, Aries. Do not sleep with this person because they have an agenda. They already got paid to, you know what I'm saying, but you ended this cycle, honey, and you kept your distance, and he's sad. Things didn't work out like he planned. That's because you are a fucking oracle. You are on two priests, and you seen it coming. Okay? And this is why they want you to. Because you are a moon goddess. You are a Medusa. And they want to mix your mind, your spirit with this beast and create a new species. They don't want to mix him with the karmic. They want to mix him with you. <laughs> wow. Well, this is what's going on in the energy of my Aries, guys. I tell you, it gets deep. It gets deep, y'all. You got somebody trying to hybrid, hybridize, hybridize you and create a new species. But you use your intuition because you are an Antu. You are an Antu. And you ended the cycle with this person and he is sad. Did him and his group is over here trying to get you in this marriage, get you in this foundation. They're trying to disrupt your life. They're trying to stop you from moving forward. And they're working really hard to get you to be in a partnership with this person. They want you to be in a two of cups with this person so things can move forward. He's tired of juggling his finances. They need resources. The church needs resources. So this person wants to be in a commitment with you. Because you are not two. Because of your energy. Wow. Wow, Aries. Be cautious of this person. Keep your boundaries. And stay safe, uh, Aries. Keep doing what you're doing. I mean, you're using your intuition and discernment to the fullest. And you're using it correctly. So, you know what's right to do. <laughs> well, I love you, ladies. If you feel anybody could benefit from this, please send it to them. But the word, what's the word? What's the word for Aries? It's OGT, Oxford Genome Technology Institute. They're trying to hybridize. They're trying to make a new species and take your DNA to do it. All right. All right. I love y'all. And as I always end it, ladies, please know thyself, know thyself, know thyself. I'll see you guys on my next What's the Word. Y'all be easy. Bye-bye.